through a lifetime spent in the pursuit of knowledge, one question consumed me. How did our world come to be? The old ones perished a thousand years ago, triggering the extinction of all life. She showed me how it was reborn. A little outcast girl, ignorant of her own importance. Through her, I learned that life was only saved through a technological miracle. Zero Dawn. A terraforming system composed of nine subordinate functions. Each playing its part to reshape Earth from a barren rock to a lush landscape. Tended and protected by the machines. And with her, I learned the deepest secret of them all. The secret of her birth. That she is a clone of Elizabeth Subek, Zero Dawn's creator. Born to prevent a new extinction. Driven by Hades, a malevolent AI. Given sentience by a mysterious signal of unknown origin. And with a little help from me. She prevailed in a great battle at the city of Meridian. Becoming a champion for all humankind. But as useful as she has been, now... I must leave her behind. For as she strives to put right what Hades sundered, I have made a new discovery. One that heralds both destruction and opportunity. Hey, what's up guys? Darty here, and I've been waiting to play this game all day. This game looks amazing, but without further ado, let's get into this. We're gonna play. Let's, uh, let's go easy. Watch all the cutscenes, skip nothing. of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then... extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AIU designed to control the system.
But every time I think I have a lead, it comes to nothing. And every night, I have the same dream. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky, through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me, even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. Case you know that the armor whole. she's wearing is the most powerful armor in the first game. It's called it Shield Lasts. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So! What are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the Blight. Both, actually, but, um... I, I should... Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you. No matter what, you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Okay, but if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> A focus? Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. As it looks like in the game, you see like this all the focuses time. Focuses are basically the <clears throat> technology of the post or pre-apocalyptic world. They used the holographic designs in their infrastructure. I mean, Shall they're we? smart enough to create AI to terraform a planet. <laughs> Elizabeth's so bad. All right, I 
Got a couple of scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants. Stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. These plants don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. The focus helps you see the ones we need. We should keep going. Might want to grab more of these plants along the way. Yeah, good idea. <coughs> oh, whatever I just touched was slimy. I'll take your word for it. Those ruins, that's where we need to go. I don't know how to put these ropes here, but we can use the line to slide down. What are we after exactly? The backup? Well, um, it's an AI. It's, um, it's hard to explain. Think of it like a set of instructions that can fix the world. Sounds complicated. Yeah, I, um, ran into some trouble on the way here. Lost a lot of my gear. More blight. It's everywhere. <coughs> oh, it's hard to breathe around this stuff. Relax. Salvaging machine carcasses as usual. And there they go. Looks like they left a carcass behind. Ah, so an improvement of the other game is they improved the slide. It's a lot more cohesive now. A lot of arrows in that machine. Better take a closer look. This game basically revolves around you making your own medicine. Feels good. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else will come? I don't know. The good thing we. One thing I need to do is. Some arrows of our own. Might be trouble up ahead. Uh. 
There's a ladder. But can't reach it from here. Nothing a well-placed arrow can't knock free. Just have to target the lock. Get it. After you. By the goddess. What was this place? I don't know. The transmission... The, uh, message I found. Didn't say. Only that a backup might be here. We need to find a way in. So, um... What happened after I left Meridian? Well, there was a fuss when people realized you were gone. But then some of us figured you only would have left if it were for something important. You were right about that. Blight makes my throat Blight's itch. It's not just poisoning plants. It's killing animals, too. Then people will get sick, too. And starve. We're not gonna let that happen. I don't think there's a way through. Down this way. Get to the grass. Never seen one of those before. Me neither. A new type of machine already. Those dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. Give it a second. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. I'm ready. Okay, concentrate. Anything good? A few supplies. Another one's coming. How does the Focus know all that? It reads data on the machine. Like a hunter studying its prey? Yeah, kind of. So after the 
fuss over me leaving. What did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration was over, my mother led the rest of the Nora home. The Sun King put his people to work rebuilding the city. And I set out to find you. Got it. child, right? Yeah. Found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. That's good to have extras. Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them? Please hold for identity scan. Access denied. Please wait here for personnel to assist you. Dr. Sobek. Okay. I guess they weren't on great terms with Elizabeth. Well, let's find a way in. Please hold for identity scan. Access denied. Credentials not recognized. I guess it doesn't like me either. I should be able to pry this open. There's climbing gear. Guess someone dropped in from above. Whoever left this here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? Ugh, what's that stench? Entire camp wiped out. They must have come here to Delph for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. Then through the wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. New combat style in this game looks really good compared to the first one. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. Some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Oh, God. Oh, this stuff that burns. Burned right through his armor. Part of a machine could help fix the gears. Because there is a Cobra machine. All right, I think I. <clears throat> I'm thinking it's the the Cobra. All 
right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Or maybe even make something better. You could use this workbench. Crafting system is even better. There, a uh, pole caster. Now to test it on the debris. better than I thought. Well, it doesn't look like there's an easy way out of here. I should scan the area. We have to find a way to keep going. Huh. What's this thing for? Whoa. Good morning. I'm Oswald Dalgard, and it is my pleasure to introduce you to Far Zenith. Forget what you think you know about us. Our truth is simple. We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there. Please proceed into the auditorium, where we'll unveil our plans. Wonder what's in this auditorium. Guess we'll find out. I don't think a pulse from my focus is enough here. I better scan the area. Oh, I might be able to get up there. I don't think I'm doing this right. That's cool. That works. That pull caster is useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry. I'll find you another way up. It's gonna take getting some getting used to. <clears throat> you still you double click X while midair. Okay. Okay, I gotta drop the ladder for Varl. Get the basic gist of this game. I will stream more tomorrow, but I want to play solo for right now.